Hey everyone, Hunter Ingram here, and I'm gonna give you your weekend five for the week of February 19th through February 25th. Now we're gonna start with a New Hanover County Board of Commissioners meeting on Monday, where they're gonna decide if they're gonna give a financial incentive package worth $350,000 in cash payments over five years to National Gypsum to bring their business back to Wilmington and obviously bring those jobs with them. Um, they're gonna decide on that on Monday morning at the New Hanover County Courthouse um, at 9 a.m. So if you're interested in hearing what they're gonna talk about and you know kind of where they are on this issue with National National Gypsum, you can go out and visit them. Um, also on Tuesday, the New Hanover County Board of Education is going to approve its final plan, or at least they could approve their final plan for the high school redistricting. And uh, that's gonna be at a work session where the public can sign up and uh, speak on those issues uh, before the actual meeting and then obviously listen to the deliberation from the board um, after that. That's gonna be at 5.30 and that's gonna be at 1805 South 13th Street. So if you're interested in that issue, go ahead and go out there. Now, um, this week on Tuesday and Wednesday, k for Stage is going to welcome the Broadway tour of Cabaret, and that's going to be um, just for two days. So if you are interested in seeing Cabaret, which is the tale of a, um, it's set during the, uh, uh, the in Nazi Germany in Berlin, um, in, about a stage show in uh, in Berlin, then you can go see that. That's gonna be uh, at Cape Fear Stage. They're gonna be 8 p.m. shows each night, um, and tickets are still available, and you can get them at capefearstage.com. Um, and then later in the week, we're gonna see the state playoffs begin for the high school boys and girls basketball teams. Um, you can see the schedule up on our website uh, and you're going to obviously be able to follow along with us as well on, on that. So um, go to Star News Online for the latest coverage and again you can see the schedule there. Thanks everyone. Bye.